Okay, Harish, let's get the hell out of this place. It's dark in here, so don't stray too far from me and my lamp. It's dangerous. Oh. Hmm, that wall. What is it, Master Zale? There's something strange about that wall. Leave it to me. I'll take a look. I had a certain feeling about this wall. Call it my archaeologist's intuition. If we look around, there might be more places like this. Right. Let's keep at it. Ha! I've still got it! My intuition never lets me down. Hmm. That wall. Oh, crap. Ooh. Oh! It seems the explosion knocked a bag free. A bag of what? Okay, what do we do with the bag? Oh, nothing, we just got a load of gold out of it. One that we can't get to. Hmm. I bet we can shoot it from a distance. There we go. Let's we'll see if there's any upgrades. I don't think we can upgrade too much. Because we haven't got any items. Is there anything else or not? Let's go on the hands and knees. It's a bit nippy in here. I think it's colder further in. You're right, Moranya. A well here? Curious. It's just a well. That, mm, that wall. Just go and explode as well. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it seems the explosion knocked a bag free. I'm getting plenty of money for that. Is any more? Oh, there's another. Hmm, that wall. No bug that time. how much damage I'm taking as well. Oh, seems this spring is brimming with a mysterious energy. Have a drink, see what it does. Huh? I can feel all that prison grime washing away. 
Ich ist beide. Fucking Spiders. Always open. Hmm. That wall. Uh, health, health regenerated. So I'll check it out myself. I think if I'm doing it because I'm inexperienced at oh. opening doors. It seems the explosion knocked a bag free. It explodes. We get a bag of gold. So it's worth taking a bit of damage. Because I presume if Horace does it, then we don't get the gold. I do like the auto equip feature. Ooh. That's a nice sword we've got. Which one is it? The blood sword plus five. Hmm, that wall. Horace, could you take a look at that wall? That wall there. Hmm, let's see. Yeah, I thought as much. Oh, what in the world is oh. that? I'll go. Stay out of sight. This doesn't feel right. Be careful, Zale. It's going to be something big and nasty. Knew it. Lots of big nasties. More guys, you can come out now. I'm stuck and I can't move much, guys. Better help. Chest in there, or not? Before we got sidetracked. No, we didn't. Let's see if there's any more in this area before we move along. Come on, guys. Hmm. 
Oh, this place is remarkably eerie. It's so dark, I can hardly see. Oh, help me! Oh, it's just a rock. Let's take a look around. Curiosity killed the cat, you know? It's only a little look. It's a good job we're not cats. I wonder where he gets his confidence from. Oh. <laughs> Undead sorcerers, undead archers. There's some spiders. Oh, we need to get rid of that guy as soon as possible. through here something is controlling the souls of the dead oh who would do such a thing there's no use standing around here shouting let's find it hmm that wall I've got it guys I'm just gonna blow myself up again Seems the explosion knocked her back free. I can put up with the explosions if I get plenty of gold. Which way, guys? This way? No, we, that's the way we came then. There's a door. And there's another one. lead to the same place I wonder hmm that wall I've got it excellent more treasure Horace <gasps> At least a minor concussion. Don't move! We'll come down! Oh. I don't want to go down. Leaving Horace alone. Leaving Horace alone probably isn't very nice. Probably. Probably. Alright. I wanted to at least try and get to the chest. Could be full of gold coins. And we just go and leave it there. Now then. 
My archaeologist blood is racing. It seems there are quite a few mysteries on this island. Horace, aren't we just going deeper and deeper? Will this really help us escape? Uh, of course. See, wind is coming from further inside. If there's wind, then there must be an exit to the surface somewhere. Wouldn't you say so? No, it might oh, just be an air vent. Oh, that wall. There's one. Is there any more? How's that place? Like well, statues of ogres or or something. indeed it's using some kind of ancient magic to control the s ah here it is could have warned me Harris That Mr. Necromancer, where's he gone? Oh, 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 it's, it's dark! It's dark! Horace, Horace! Calm down and light a lamp. Right, Master Zale. It got away. Soon it will leak sliced and diced his ass as well. We gotta follow him down. Coffee move. The aura in here is different from before. It's conjecture, but I would say this is an ancient tomb. So then that thing we thought was some kind of guardian. More undead shit. Including an undead king. You get rid of that sorcery. I wonder. I mean, corpses at me. Kill this wizard guy.
Jesus Christ. off. I really can't move out the corner, that's bullshit. Glad we got him. Some of these enemies are starting to get a bit more tough now. Anyway, let's follow this blood splatter. Let's find out where that necromancer guy's gone. Unless there's anything else around. Nope. Oh, we're in that area where we could see before. No doubt he's going to take over these statues and I've got to defeat them. What does that do? It's in here. Indeed. What? Me? Okay, if you say so. I've got your back, kid. <laughs> Instant movement. All right for some. No time for glib remarks. Just keep trying to hit it. It's a necromancer. Careful of the monsters it summons. Oh, so all the monsters were being controlled by that necromancer. We have to stop it before we're surrounded. It wouldn't be nice if it's controlling us. Watch this. Oh, crap. Jesus Christ, I'm getting slaughtered. Come on guys, wake up. I'll keep you occupied. Oh, if I dirty magic at me.
Where's it gone? Come on guys, get up. Need your hand. Need a hand. Let's get this fucker. Is he gone? Fuck off with you, petrify. Any more for any more. Right, where's Harry's? Let's see if we can upgrade anything. Sunstone. Sell some shit then, because I've got loads of shit. Don't know if any of it's going to come in handy or not though. Can't sell that. Sure, we can upgrade any equipment. 
No. Okay, let's get on with it. We can use this, Master Zael. What is it? A very special treasure. A little wall of ice will pose no challenge to the powers of this stone. Looks like a Garak sunstone to me. Exactly. Very astute of you. Go on, give it a try. Okay. Big work to treat. Ha! I knew it! The exit should be up ahead. Huh? And what do we have here? A dead end? Horace, no way. I'm sorry. But I wasn't wrong. If you would look up, you'll see that it does indeed connect to the outside. And who's gonna climb this? Um... <laughs> um... Scholarly types do have a rather peculiar brand of humor, don't they? So can we climb this or not? I have to say, this place is really weird. The whole chamber is steeped in magic. It must have taken a mage of tremendous power to make something like this. Oh. What's up? <laughs> Ooh, an old book! Look at the script, it's ancient! Lazarus Island. And there's a map of the island. I can't read anymore, I'm afraid. If only we had some kind of reference. There are books in the castle from the time of the first count. Perhaps if we went to the library? Either way, we can't stay here. Let's go back. I honestly thought we might find an exit. It's fine. We got some exercise. Better than being stuck in a cell. True. Plus, I'm really looking forward to studying this book. Is this really the time to be getting so excited? Excited? I'm not the one who fell down a hole. Ah, uh, um... <laughs> <laughs> Master Zale, you take this sunstone. You could probably put it to better use than I could. Cheers. Very good of you. their escape attempt a failure, Zale and the others return to their cell. Just in time, by the looks of things. Wake up, you! Feeding time! How was I? General Astor! You came to see us? Therius told me everything. You've been through quite the ordeal. However, Master Dagron is working hard to clear your name with the Count. You must be patient. Thank you for your concern. Although I must say, bringing Lady Callista to the Gorak base was rather rash, wouldn't you agree? You must have had a reason. Won't you tell me? Yeah, why not? I really can't tell him. Okay. Would telling the truth implicate the Lady Callista in some way, perchance? I'm very sorry, General. I'm really grateful that you came here, but I can't. It's fine, Master Zale. If you're so determined to stay silent, I think it's rather clear what's going on. In any case, 
You must not be so rash. Well, getting a little reckless now and then can be a good thing. Come, eat up. Let me know how it tastes. I do like to hear praise about my cooking. <laughs> What? Is that true? If you would like, my lord, I can present you with all of the evidence. You surely do not understand the significance of this yourself. I can't say I haven't heard a few rumors, but I'm not so foolish as to try and dig through the secrets of a powerful man like you. Hmm. You are a wise man. But Lord Jural seems hell-bent on proving the boy's guilt. What can we do? I just might have a few ideas, my lord. Such as? Hmm, oh. what's going on here? I'm not sure if I need a praise or not. No, I don't. I heard there's a secret place under the castle that nobody can get into. There must be some right good treasure there, I thought. So I snuck in. Of course, they found me in no time. Just what have they got hidden down there? What indeed? He's been telling everyone how he slaughtered a hundred Garak. But it's all lies. He stood at the back whimpering while we did all the fighting. He'd rather that wasn't known, so he had me thrown in here. Not a decent bone in his body. Yeah, he's so full of shit. I'm getting really hungry. I've just had some food. Should have said. A lot's changed here since the current count arrived. If anyone says a bad word against him, bang, you end up here. Uh, oh, you missed. The guard came three times while you were away. Actually, he's really nice once you get chatting to him. He even, uh, forgot that you were gone. Isn't that nice? <laughs> Isn't it? So that's how you get all those girls to give you the time of day. I don't need that sunstone again. When are we going to get out of here? Seriously. It can't end like this. I don't know. What's that? What's what? We couldn't check anything before. Zale, time for more questioning. Come on! No, oh, not again.
Zael's inquisition continued as further testimonies were presented. Zael stood resolute, uttering not a single word as he waited for the final judgment. Surely dragging this out any further is a waste of time. He won't defend himself. That is as good as a confession. I believe capital punishment is in order. I trust you agree, my lord. Do you really have nothing to say? Punish me if you have to. Just leave my friends out of it. Let them go. My, how admirable of you. Very well. I have no objection to this. You're the only one I'm after. I couldn't care less about your filthy mercenary friends. Ah, I do apologize. I know I wasn't summoned, but I thought I'd just poke my nose in. Oh, and I hope you don't mind, but I brought someone along who'd like to have her say. Callista? I have one thing I want to say to you all. The decision to go to the Garak base with this man and his friends was mine alone. They were worried about my safety. They told me I should return to the castle. But I wouldn't listen. I made them take me to the base. I... I do not understand. Why would you knowingly put yourself in such danger? No, Callista. Don't tell them. How goes the investigation? Your lordship, I, uh... Would you show me your hand? Ah, this could only be the mark of the outsider. The what? Allow me to explain. You see, there is a legend passed down in the Argonan family. When Lazarus Island is in crisis, a man with the mark of the outsider will appear as the island's savior. That savior stands before you today. No, it's inconceivable. Assuming I am correct, I need not tell you of the great significance this man could hold for us. In these dark times, he is a beacon of hope. Why would such a man ever think to kidnap Lady Callista? Lord Geral, are you sure you are not somehow? Mistaken. My lord. Lord Gerald might be forgiven for making such an error of judgment. Such is his deep devotion to my niece. Isn't that right, Lord Gerald? If you put it like that, my lord, you may be correct. Ha! Then this is a cause for celebration. Not only do I have a wonderful future nephew in Jural, but now also a brave warrior to defend my people. Lazulus Island is surely saved! Yay for freedom! <clears throat> then I declare the accused innocent of all charges. Take it no one has any objections? Master Zael showed true courage in the face of such torment. I'm glad we made it in time. Thank you, everyone. He thinks he can disgrace me like that and get away with it. Oh, you'll see. You'll see. Oh dear, he's pissed. What a shame. Haha. <laughs> he was free to go, his name cleared. It wasn't long before his friends in the dungeon were also released. 
After stretching their weary bodies and bathing in the sun's light, they all gathered in the great hall. Good going, Zael. We've been acquitted. Ah, uh, my body's aching from that damn cell. I'm gonna sleep for a week. But I wonder why they released us. Did they have a sudden change of heart? I don't know. I can hardly believe it myself. Who cares? We should be celebrating. I'm gonna drink till my arms fall off. Hmm. Yeah, but first I have to find General Astar and thank him. But first things first. Let's see if we can find a save point. So you're Zael. The General is waiting for you in the courtyard. Go now. The General asked for you himself. You should be honoured. Very honoured. Suits you, sir. Let's have a venture into the courtyard then. See where Mr. General is. Why, it's Master Zale. I'm glad your head is still attached to your body. So am I, believe me. I can't thank you enough, General. Me? No. Master Dagrin is the one who bent the Count's ear. I was only there for show in the end. But you brought Lady Callista. That's what made all the difference. Gerald wouldn't have backed down otherwise. Well, then you should thank the lady herself, along with the others who helped win your freedom. All I did was lend Lady Callista a hand. How could I not, when I saw her deep concern for your safety? Zale, the truth is absolute, unchanging, but sometimes petty emotions drive people to distort the truth. And yet emotions can also drive people to seek it out. Those are the people you ought to treasure. Yes. However, if what the Count said is true, I fear our troubles have only just begun. That mark of yours represents an even greater power than I imagined. You must be careful not to lose yourself. Power is best used by someone with the strength of heart to wield it. <laughs> it's a bit of a cheesy grin. I'll bear that in mind. Sorry, folks. I just can't get enough for being a knight. It's fantastic. Just a little practice every day, then we do what we want. Best job ever. Yeah, sounds great. Just in time for what? Dear Zale, stop killing my mates, you nasty git. Your thrashing is waiting for you at the cliff beyond the castle's east gate. It's a one-on-one -on -one battle, so come alone. Alone means no one else. Get it? Okay. I'm going to regret this, I think, but hey-ho. 
Do love a good challenge. What the fuck's that? Uh, smash to pieces. Shut up, monkey boy. I thought he was coming alone. Oh yeah. Have some of this then. Oh yeah. Oh, I love that. Oh. This much of him fall off though. <laughs> I can't see where the hell I'm going. I'm having the smashing time because all these guys. <laughs> so long, suckers. I win. Oh, it didn't give me a chance to pick loads of goodies up, though. Oh, well. I still guess we won. I want to keep that thing as a pet. No, I don't do it again. Not again. Maybe come back later. Maybe it's just a way of gaining some extra XP. You're Zale. The Count summons you to his chamber. Do not delay. The Count? Indeed. His chamber is on the second floor. Your friend Dagrin is already on his way. Okie dokie. Let's get on up to the second floor then. Master Zale, the Count's chamber is one floor above. There will be some knights guarding the door. Please look for them. Okay. A lot of earth. I'll do that. The Count's chamber is just ahead. Is it this one? Master Zale, the Count awaits you. I know what he does. My lord? Ah, just the man I was looking for. Now, about your right hand. Dagrun has briefed me, but I would like to hear the details from you. How exactly did you receive that mark? Let me explain. I see. This is a curious turn of events indeed. Why would it give you its power? Well, I'm sure we'll find out eventually. By the way, Lady Callisto was worried sick about you. My lord, I assure you that Lady Callista had nothing to do with this. <laughs> Settle down. If I fretted every time that girl went off on her own, why, I'd never have a moment's peace. Now that I think about it, Perhaps it is fortuitous that you and Callista became so close. Depending on your answer, 
I might even reconsider her engagement. Uh, my... answer? As you know, Lazarus has been like the sword of the Empire, fighting the Gorak and other foreign enemies for hundreds of years. Geral and Callista's marriage would certainly give us great influence within the Empire. But it is only a means to an end. My true goal has always been to annihilate the Gorak and bring peace to the Empire. But is that even possible? It will not be easy, of course, but that power of yours may be the deciding factor. With your help, it might just be possible. Mate, I don't know what you're frowning about. This is our chance. I doubt we'll get another one. I know that. But I just... It's not me the Count wants. What he wants is... The power of the Outsider. Is that really a good thing? That's none of our concern. If you think you can't handle it, you better get yourself sorted. Just give me some time, Dagrin. I need to figure things out. All right, then. Go and clear your head. If you swear absolute loyalty to me, I will knight you and your friends. And if you so desire, even marrying Callista might not be out of the question. Was that Callista? No. Tell me she wasn't listening. I have to catch up to her. The thought alone. Callista's room is there. Through here are the guest rooms and the ballroom. Lady Callista went to her room looking very depressed. I hope she's all right. She'll be fine. Callista's not in her room. Where'd she get to? Lady Callista just left. Said she wanted to feel the wind on her face. Okay. I could have done that for her. She's not been kidnapped. No. Don't be stupid. Don't just drop in. The Count may think you're innocent, but I know better. You'll never be anything more than a mercenary. The life of nobility is not easy. Shut up, you prick. I don't like him. Callista? Callista? Not here either. This is a nice room. I think I'll take this one if it's spare. It's even got its own built in save point. Wait, Callista! Callista, thank you. They declared me innocent because of you. That's okay. You were protecting me as well. That's why you didn't tell them the truth, right? Well, sure. I... Zael, can I talk to you about something? 
I overheard you talking to my uncle. What? Please, you have to refuse his offer. What? Why? We can... I mean, I haven't decided anything. But think about it. It would all be over. You wouldn't have to marry Jural. You don't understand. There were people who did everything they could. People who saw the situation I was in and tried to help me. But my uncle or Jural would always find out. And something terrible would happen. So many people hurt because of me. Listen to me, Zahil. I might not have a clue about the outside world, but I know this world a lot better than you do. It's not some fairy tale world of knights and princesses like in the stories. People cheat and murder for their own gain without batting an eyelid. There is no freedom here, only treachery and deceit. I don't want you to live in a world like that. So what then? You'll just marry Jarrell. You're okay with that? Of course not. I just can't let you get caught up in this too. chosen one has appeared. Now this island will become the most powerful fortress in the world. The Empire, no. The whole world will be mine. <laughs> oh dear. He's a crackpot. Will domination. Don't think it's going to happen somehow, mate. Master Zale, I have a message from your friends. They said they're going back to the tavern. They seem quite worried about you. I'll go find them, eh? It's a difficult decision. Just be sure to consider your own feelings first and foremost. I feel certain that Callista would like you to do the same. I doubt any of us will criticize you, no matter what you decide. I don't really care about all this night business. Just let me swing a sword around and enjoy the odd drink. That's all I need. But, uh, I'd hate to work with that prat from the other day. Who did he think he was? Anyway, it's up to you. Hmm, I think I'd go for it. I mean, yeah, working for the Count won't be a bed of roses. But I don't think knights have to do so much dirty work. The mercenary business isn't one you stain for life. Oh, I'm the worst father in the world. Hi, Zale. Did you hear? Horace is going around town looking for you. Is he now? There was a man in a robe. He kidnapped my daughter. The swine. I, I tried to chase after him, but he tore me to shreds. I didn't stand a chance. Oh, damn it all to hell. What can a normal guy like me do in a situation like this? I've never even touched a weapon before. How can I rescue my daughter? Hey. Man up, jeez. Could you find out where he's keeping her? Oh, thank you. First, you'll have to find the man in the robe and follow him. Okay. Okay. 
Did you decide what you're doing about the Count's offer? Not yet. Bear in mind, this doesn't just affect you. We all have a stake in this. We can get out of this way of life. No more waking up every morning and wondering if that's the day we die. It works out well for Callista too. There's a lot for you to think about. Yeah, I know. Well, it seems like a pretty easy decision to me. Even if you do swear allegiance, it's not like you have to stick to it. And you get a girl out of it. Why say no? If you spend too long thinking about it, you'll only miss your chance. Yeah, you're probably right. Okay. You know that kid, you can fall off. That's nice to know, kid. Let's make a save before carrying on. 